What's good, YouTube? Or expert? Hey, how are you doing? Beautiful day today. Um, yes, this is Summer Deanne's analysis video. Sort of. Not really. No, that's a fucking... Bro, my brain? I can't register words. No, this is Summer Deanne. The new unit just came out today. 55,000 CC because I'm just built a little stupid. Um, if you don't know what she's used for, she's used for death matches. More specifically, she's made to three turn original demon. She can also three turn Crimson Demon, and if you like doing extreme difficulty, the other demons as well, since she's actually usable in the other demons. But this is her passive increases allies' skill ranks at the start of battle if the allies in deathmatch are all from different races. Increases their basic stats by 30%. And applies debuff immunity for three turns. She is literally made to three turn original demon. So that's exactly what we're going to do today. We're going to go try to three turn original demon. You should like, subscribe. We're going to run to 300 subscribers. We're at like 379 on the time of recording this. So hopefully we go up in the, in this month. It's looking a little nice this time of night, the time of year. So yeah, let's go ahead and hop into some original demon death matches. Okay, we have made it to original demon. Um, one thing I did hear about Summer DM though is that your teammate also needs Summer DM for this to be viable, or for her to be viable, and I get that. But I just want to see if I can actually do it with this guy. He changed to Freyer, interestingly enough. He has no gear on Freyer, interestingly enough. Um, please don't do this to me, bro. Come on, man, this is already in a recording. Don't do me like this. Come on, put Arthur back on, please. Um, uh, or at least give your man some gear. Uh, okay, 21. That's good enough. I gotta just put CC food. Actually, no, I don't. But I'll just use attack food because why the fuck not? And hopefully we win. This is the first run using DN without a DN teammate. So hopefully, I. It's not as hard as people make it out to be. If we can still three turn it, that would be nice. But probably not. But we'll see though. Let's see how this actually works. Without a GM partner. For the first run, anyway. Itsuki. I like that name. It's just Mitsuki. I'm them. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, and if anyone's running while I'm so energetic, I just had a good day. And no one's in the house. So I can be as loud as I fucking want. For the time being. Uh. Okay. I don't know exactly what to do with this. That's the problem here. I don't know what the meta for this actually is. Okay, he's just going in. Okay. I'll do the same, I guess. Let's start off with this. I don't know if this is killing or not. I have no idea if this is... No, that's definitely not killing. It, unless it, it is man's DPS. Is, oh my god, it's not existent. Okay, hopefully Dian shows out. Amplify. Not bad. 135. For power strike. AoE, which is weird. Okay. So we definitely want a three turn. Okay, okay. So if I like amplify single target with Freyr, then single target with Meliodas, I think that would kill without my teammate having to do anything. This man's worried about rank ups. Like, that's fine, I guess. Like, yeah, this team is its not designed to three turn because he doesn't have a DN on the team. So, so I'm just letting us get gameplay of DN unoptimally first. And then we'll go find a teammate that actually is using DN. That hurt. Okay. So he's ranking up and I can kill. Fuck him up, Freyr. Good damage, good damage. That's two turns, unfortunately, so last turn is going to be a little rough. That's what, um, your boy Freyr's ultimate comes in, being 6-6 six, six and all. So technically, I don't even need the end, because this ult is just stupid. He's got another rank up. That's unused. Don't rank up again, please. Okay. Um, he's just going to rank up. I'm going to do this. I'm going to trust this power strike to do some crazy damage. Mm. I feel like that's enough to kill, so... Yeah, no damage cap. We should kill here. Hopefully, he doesn't hit under the number, you know? That'll be unfortunate. Okay, don't hit him under the number cap, please. Okay, now I might hit him under the number cap. I don't, I don't know, Dian. You got this? Oh, thank God. Oh, 
She didn't hit him under the cap. 600k, no crit? God damn, bro. Melios can one tap that turn. All right, but this time I'm going into phase three with no DN buff. So this is unfortunately unfortunate. Is this Freyer 6-6? Six, six? I lost all of my buffs. Jesus. Hopefully it's Freyer 6-6. Six, six. Okay. Okay. Are you using your ultimate? You're not. That's unfortunate. We're going to do that. The Amplify's not going to really hurt, help me. So the end's kind of useless. That's probably not killing, but it's going to get pretty close. Hmm, that was a good talk. 231. That's a lot lower than I thought it would be. Cool. Am I hitting for 231 or less? Heck for more. And I don't even have a buff on this this man's. That's interesting. He has more CC than me, which is weird. How the hell did you accomplish that when my team is like obviously superior in damage? I don't know, man. I guess he just has a lot of HP defense going on here. I have three attack crit units, so that, I guess that makes sense to understand. Okay, this is gonna hurt. Dian's dead, but I have a Freyer ult, so it's fine. Because Freyer is a resistance roll, so he's not gonna be taking a lot of damage in general. I got this. I got this, bros. I could use Dian in the back. I mean, not Dian, Elaine in the back, and I'd be doing stupid damage, but I don't trust my team's CCs, and I don't have my Elaine 90, let alone SA6. I'm gonna give him a little thumbs up because we actually did it when I was using the end and he wasn't. I'm not mad at it. It's not like irrelevantly impossible to do it without a DN teammate. Oh damn, that's unfortunate, bro. I'll show you a 6 6 ultimate real quick. So, yeah, it's possible to do it without a DN teammate if they actually, you know, have two attack units like he did. I mean, Arthur wouldn't be bad either. I mean, we did it. It wasn't a problem. It wasn't hard at all. We just didn't three-turn because he didn't have a DN. Which is fine. Not everyone's going to summon for DN, and I get that because that's the roast of the guy released or whatever. So, let's go ahead and hop into the next one with an actual DN team. Alright, we finally found ourselves a DN player. It only took a very long time because nobody summoned for this character. But we have ourselves a DN team, and he's pretty good. His CC's way higher than mine. He has a pretty built-out Meliodas, actually. His association must be crazy. Mine isn't the best, but he has 21,000 CC. Jesus Christ. Uh, I feel like when my fucking remember. I don't know. Because Meliodas is definitely more intimidating than mine. I'll say that for sure. Let's give myself some attack food, because why not? Um, 21. Interesting. Okay. Let's go ahead and get it going. Let's see if we can three turn this with an actual DN on the other team. That's you. That what is this for? So hopefully this works out. And I don't screw up because again, this is my second time using the on original demon. So I don't actually know the go-to like cards to use on turn one and shit like that. I'm trying to learn it though. Hmm. He has a rank up, which is dope, obviously. So how does this work? Does it, am I supposed to be one shot in this face? I'm gonna say I am. Let's do this. I don't want this to merge, unfortunately, but whatever. Anyway. It should one shot, I assume? If it doesn't, I'd be awkward. He looks like he he's very either contemplating or like I fucked up. Yeah, okay, that makes sense to use the AoE here. Alright, let's see this. Oh fuck, wait. I don't have an opener for this turn actually. So I guess I shouldn't use that card. I mean, I have a DN opener. But she jammed. <laughs> she hitting kind of stupid. Alright. That's cool. Record. Uh, is that opening? I think that is. Uh, I'm gonna go with he's opening this, and I'm gonna do this. Ah, uh, fuck. 
I want to get ultimate, but I don't have Freya's ultimate to get. Did it, wow, he didn't. Oh, I thought he couldn't open for a second. Did his card did, didn't crit, which is important. Okay, we're killing this phase, but I don't know how we're gonna get through the next phase in one turn. We definitely used all our good cards, and he didn't pull a Gother rank up, I think. Yeah, my being hits way harder than his. I don't know what's. Oh, uh, I don't know what his back end is. If his back end is a lane, that would make sense. For him to hit harder than me, but if not, I don't know what's going on here. Please let me have a rank up. He does. Nice. Alright. Let's do this. Pop this and then this. Question mark? Alright. My boy hit pretty decent. Hit for, is that damage cap? I feel like he has damage cap for some reason. They beat him up, bucket, 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 bucket boys? Bucket boys, yeah, that makes sense. Ooh, damn. Free turn. That wasn't the most complicated thing ever. But it works quite easily. Alright, let's get another one in. Just because, we make the video like 15 minutes, why not? Let's go ahead and find another DN teammate. Alright, we got another DN teammate. Uh, is this the same guy? No. His TC is extremely low, Jesus Christ. Oh, okay, never mind. He puts gear somewhere. I don't I didn't see what happened. The CC's back up. Oh, it must be his combat cluster, right? Damn, your combat class is crazy low. Okay, um I'll use combat class food this time. Just because I want to switch out Bon and give myself a lane. Because my lane isn't built. But she is 6'6 now, thanks to their banner, so. 291,000 CC, that's pretty good. This is definitely enough to go first, correct? Yeah. Okay, we're good. All right, let's try to use this team with a lane instead of a Ragnarok bun in the back. See how this goes. If our teammate wants to start, okay, we're good. Yeah, he can definitely three turn it. Like four to five turns with a nine to dance. Team. That's fine. Oh, he's holding his wave. So it's opening my door. The family is back, by the way. If you couldn't tell. Um. Let's see. Z ranking up, correct? Okay, I got an idea now. Let's go with this card, this card, and then this. Because I think the cancel stance is going to hit as hard as the normal cleave card. If he crits. My mother is talking to me. Hold on. Yeah! <laughs> no! Thank you, mother. Okay, the stance card definitely works as a better opener. Especially in this phase. And I basically... Well, he wasted it on a single part, so... This is a very strong opening. Okay, let's do this. Pop this. Amplify here. Hmm, can I get his ultimate? No, I can't. Let's go for the power strike. Hmm, he wasted his? I don't think that's necessary, I'm gonna be real. Actually, shit. We might not even be able to, we might get stuck in, in limbo. I think we're gonna get stuck in limbo. Hopefully we're not just like, okay, we're not, oh, okay, come on, DN, you got this, if you can kill, and we're stuck in limbo, fuck, okay, that just cucked us, so that AoE power strike is not the best card for damage, at, like, towards the end of phase two, especially, yeah, it gets you stuck in limbo, that's annoying, so we're not three turning it, it's fine, that hurt, nigga, chill, you should be with razor beams. That did a lot of damage to Freya. He's going again? Can you leave him alone? He doesn't have region, bro. Chill. And he took out my old gauge, you piece of crap. Alright, he's not a limbo anymore. Do you have a rank up? Please let me have a rank up. That's not gonna do the job. Okay, well. Oh, uh, fuck. Well. Mm. Do I need her ultimate? Fuck it, whatever. 
He's not killing, which is unfortunate. Oh, never mind. Nice. I forgot. Amplifies the thing. Right. And Meliodas is broken. Right. Look at that dude. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Let's ult here for buff. Like this and crank this. This is a 7% buff increase because I'm only got a 1 6, unfortunately. We practically Yormigan to go when you think about it. Yeah, that did nothing. That also did nothing because it's a rank 1. So I'm not entirely surprised. Tracy's gonna be a little rough. This is in one turn, phase two. 258? Oh man. It is here for nothing. That's unfortunate. Okay. So I got my ultimate, so I can kill. Is he a first? I wonder. I'll let him ult first. Freya might be dead here. I only got one car with him though, so he's not gonna hurt me that much. Just don't kill Deanne. That'd be nice. He's killing Deanne. He didn't. He killed his Deanne though. I might be able to clear this. It's possible. Hmm, actually, I don't think it's possible. Right. Let's do this, do that, and then AOB with Melly. My dog is crying. Can you not? Go. Okay, we're killing. My AOE should be the. Uh, actually, his AOE should kill. Mm, never mind. He does he not have stats? What's going on here? Okay, his AOE's definitely not killing. My AOE will, though. I, f I guess not. Alright. Gonna sue that one, but it's alright. Get a gist of it, though. Turn, uh, she can three turn it if you have a solid team. His team was just not. I mean, we got stuck in limbo, unfortunately. That wasn't nothing to do with his team and his gear or whatever. That was just us getting stuck in limbo. But yeah, let's get up out of here. And yeah, that's gonna be our showcase for Summer DN. Oh, fuck you. Fuck Bella. But yeah, Summer DN is kind of crazy. Very broken for a GD. Man. And yes, you can even compete and people. I mean, you can even do it with people without Summer DN. It's just a little more iffy. But if you have a Summer DN teammate, you're going to have a lot of fun using this unit. And I don't blame you for trying. And with that out of the way, I will see y'all in the next video. Tomorrow's video will be a slime tier list. Be on the lookout. That's, that's going to go crazy. And I'm also announcing something new I'm adding to that tier list series. Y'all see when you see it. And with that out of the way, I'll see y'all in the next video. Goodbye.